every time you go to the mall, it just feels like prices are inexorably rising. You're making the same amount of money to pay the things that are getting more expensive. It's everything. It's the services. It's a little thing. It's the taxes. It's it, everything sort of keeps coming up. But the actual task of figuring out what prices are doing on a day-to-day -day basis is more complex than just how you feel. We do about 220 items. 220 items? Every month. Vita Adams is what StatsCan calls an interviewer. She doesn't actually interview anyone. She goes from store to store and personally checks the prices of a basket of goods and services. We do auto parts. We do your dentist, we do funeral services. We wanted to tag along as Adams checked the prices, but StatsCan refused, saying it's top secret. So we brought Adams some household goods and asked her to show us how it's done. Notice price is one of the last things she looks for. Almost everything has changed sizes, and the latest one of our interviewers pointed out is tea bags. It's still 72 bags, but the number of grams have, have changed. We have to be very careful to uh, record that. So I need a, a men's shirt. Adams looks for the same product, the same brand, in the same store and checks if it's changed at all. All that is then analyzed by Richard Evans and his team in Ottawa. We want everything else to stand still so that if the price changes, it's simply because of the forces of supply and demand. So, sure, it may feel like prices are going up, but StatsCan has come to malls and stores like this across the country and actually checked the prices. And for this month, at least, they've found prices are actually going down. The CPI for January shows inflation at its lowest level in 14 months. Seasonally adjusted compared to last month, prices are down 0.2%. So next time you're checking out a product, think of Vita Adams. Check the fine print. There's more to it than just the price. Peter Armstrong, CBC News, Toronto.